Have you ever been coughed in the face? That's, that's an interesting question. I think just yesterday morning. <laughs> We're here thanks to Prospan and we are chatting all things coughs and colds in the lead up to the flu season. Now I've got Ben here and how badly have you been hit with all the bugs that our kids can get? I think we've been pretty much the entire zoo. We're pretty familiar with pretty much everything that's going around. COVID, RSV, flu, you name it. When it comes to coughs, how good are you at deciphering a cough, whether it's chesty, dry or something more serious? Cough is a cough. I would say, yeah, <laughs> though I, I don't usually try to decipher much. And what do you do when your kids get symptoms and they do get sick? Do you have any particular remedies? If they don't develop a temperature, usually nothing much other than fluids, cough sometimes, like a syrup or something. How does having a sick kid impact you as a family when it comes to work or sleep? Oh, it's massive. <laughs> I mean, it's especially during school term, just having the kids at home and lying around and mm. needing, needing care is, is super tricky. And in terms of, I guess, your kids' knowledge of managing sicknesses, how good are they? Do they know a bit about hygiene? They've been developing gradually, getting better. They can be hygienic. They're not always hygienic. So, <laughs> so, we, so we keep trying to enforce a good hygiene behavior, covering your face when you, when you sneeze or when you cough. It's an ongoing struggle. Do you prepare yourself? Do you usually have an army of things ready to go or is it usually you just deal with it when it comes? No, we start giving them vitamin C and zinc gummies at the beginning of the cold seasons and then we just cross our fingers and hope they try not to pick up too much during the season. I mean, do you know how many colds a kid can get in a year? Could technically be constant right yes like they bring it home from school and everyone gets a turn right so so they pretty much then cycle through the whole family last year flu season was absolute was horrendous right? oh my gosh I, I think we had it on and off everyone in the family like one was always down so so we hope that this year turns out a lot better than last year how do you deal with looking after sick kids when you're sick yourself it's pretty tough right yes so usually that means someone has to be off work any tips for new parents who are going in this for the first time i think especially after covid last year last year was horrible because all, all that immune system was down so I think I'm um, preparing the immune system and then obviously not eating other people's food not drinking food hygiene behavior thank you so much for sharing today and thank you Prospen for your chesty cough relief ahead of this cough and cold season thank good you luck. thank good you good luck. <laughs>